long as you dreaming about me, ain't no problem. I don't got nobody just with you right now. But the truth, I look better under you. I can lose when I'm with you. Hi friends, Angie here. Welcome and welcome back to my YouTube channel. For those who are new here, welcome to my channel and don't forget to subscribe. So today I'm back with another video and in today's video we're going to be getting ready and going to try out a new restaurant. It's not new, but it's my first time going there. So it's new to me. So we're going to this restaurant and we're going to try out their food with my friend and basically this is a get ready with me. So I'm going to take you through my skincare and my makeup and my hair and getting ready and dressed and everything so we're going to start with my skincare and I start my skincare off with a cleanser this one yeah Serhavi that's how they say it I don't speak French guys my French is very 1% but and then I use this other cleanser by Dr. Rochelle it's an aloe vera cleanser and aloe vera is very good for your skin guys and it's oil free and uh, it's anti-acne this is what it looks like and then i use this scrub also from dr rochelle it's uh, a two-in-one facial peeling and scrub did i read that right it's benefits i'm not gonna read all that but yeah this is the scrub i use after the first two cleansers so I just wash my face and a tip for people who have struggled with or are struggling with like acne or random pimples, zits, whatever you guys call them and you've tried everything like you've tried different cleansers, different skincare and it's just not helping I think one thing that really helped me was changing towels having two different towels a towel for your face and for your body because if you're using a towel for your body with your face sometimes for people who have sensitive skin it could be an issue but i've seen very many people who use one towel for their face and for their skin and their skin is even better than those who don't so like it depends it's just something you can try out and see change the towels for a bit and see uh if there's a significant change so yeah, that's tip number one. Guys, I may be telling you things you already know, but this is just me sharing my journey, the things that helped me, and yeah. So after I wash my face, like I told you guys, I apply the Serhavi uh, moisturizing cream. After I moisturize my face, I let that sink in into the skin. Yo, guys, I'm sorry. I'm so sorry. I forgot a, a step that I usually do in my skincare routine, but I don't do this every day. It's just like thrice a week. I use this, um, what do they call it? Clay mask. Yeah, it's a rose hip clay mask from Glowforce. This has also helped a lot with my acne guys this is not an, an, it's not an advertisement for any of these products it's just products that i use that i love that have helped me so yeah this is not an advertisement it's not a partnership it's just products that i love so yeah but feel free to sponsor me like hello <laughs> i use it like twice a week and it's been really helpful as you can see it's quite literally finished but yeah, I usually do this before washing my face and then I wash my face after. Oh, by the way, I got comments from my previous, 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 previous video about where I got my lashes done. If you guys want the details to where I got my lashes done, just DM me on my Instagram. You can find the link in the description box. Is it in the description? Eh! Hey. You can find the link in my bio on youtube where you see my little name 
right there like the screenshot is right here so after that i think the moisturizer has sealed in because i seem to be yapping a lot um i like to seal my skincare off with sunscreen Sunscreen is an important part of, the, of your skincare. It should be the most important part of your skincare because, yeah. I'm actually gonna be honest, I didn't use sunscreen until like a month ago. And there's been visible change to my skin, which is a good thing. I was put onto sunscreen like a month ago, like I said. Always apply sunscreen and apply it to the places where your skin is going to be exposed to the sun. Now I'm going to be doing my makeup. I haven't vlogged in a while. <laughs> and the English is non-existent. So I like to start my makeup off with this 3-in-1 primer set. It's a primer and it's it's a, a setting spray and why does it say through in one when it's just a primer and a setting spray what's the third thing is it because it's lightweight anyway uh it's this dr rochelle three in one primer set i let that sit in and yeah also, I've learned a lot with makeup from like the past few years because a primer and a setting spray do so much to your makeup. Like it just lasts longer, it looks better, it looks fresher. All the good things. So yeah, now we're gonna do my makeup and let's get into it. What do I do first? The foundation. Usually guys, I don't do foundation. I'm not a foundation girl because I feel like it's too much but like you know I'm a simple girl like I feel like I haven't really done like a full face of makeup in a while so that's what I'm gonna do so yeah let's start with the foundation I used the uh, Her Majesty Vanessa make uh, foundation in the shade what shade is this I don't know guys I don't know so I put some on my wrist Guys, I really, I really don't feel like doing foundation, but it's whatever. So I use my beauty blender. What do you guys call it? A sponge, beauty blender, beauty. What is it? Whatever it is. The ones that go the brush for better application. You know? Do you know? So anyway. me because i didn't know what i wanted and also it was my first time it was my first time like, actually buying like a full set of makeup so yeah so i was telling you guys um a short story of how the lady who helped me get this makeup was really really nice i didn't know nothing of, about makeup at the time oh this is <laughs> this is this is a concealer that i'm using yeah, she helped me pick out everything from the concealer to the to the foundation, practically everything. She was really nice and patient because I kept sending her back and forth. I'm like, this is all my color, this is all my color. I don't like this one, I don't like this one, I like this one. Give me another of this one. And she was really nice and patient. So shout out to you if you're watching. If you're not, generally, it's a big thanks to you. So like for concealer, I just do that but I know that this is the Her Majesty product Zambile it's not the new ones which is fine because it works for me because like never many new Mako had you so new products and I was like I should have waited I should have waited this is what being impatient gets me but like yeah I don't really mind it's the same thing it's all makeup so this is what i do for my concealer i add a bit more later but like these are the, the spots to show concealer and then i use the fixing spray for it to sink in 
I hate that. I hate that feeling, but okay. So yeah, let's let it sink in. Guys, it's actually raining right now. Crazy. Crazy. Like, why does it have to rain when I have plans? Do you guys see that blend? Do you see that? Ooh. Butter. Butter. Look at that. I ate that. These lashes are falling apart. Bear with me, bear with me. Bear with me. I'm gonna do my eyebrows. So for my eyebrows, I'm gonna use these two Tiros. Is it teaching to What do they call this in English? Liners. It says okay yeah i'm gonna use these two thingies these two pencils and this it's a i think it's also a concealer but for like the eyebrows it's a lighter shade than the other one specifically for eyebrows let's get into it first of all first you gotta make sure the eyebrows are aligned duh and yeah and then i just use this as like i said i'm very simple with my makeup i don't like to do too much so this is just to make them look existent you know because i have very non-existent eyebrows so yeah this is the brown one so i use this very tiny, 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 tiny brush for the eyebrows. Voila! <coughs> Bless you. Mm -hmm. Now that's what I'm talking about. And then I just So that's my skincare and makeup routine and unfortunately I cannot continue this get ready with me shredding my outfit and what I'm gonna wear because I'm running really really late I use the opportunity to dress up really quick and I think my cab is almost here so see you guys there I made the mess. Hi guys, guys. Welcome, welcome back to Angie's channel. <laughs> so today I'm with my friend Tanya. This video has been long overdue, guys. She has supposed to be in my first video, first and one. we're now on the sixth video. So you even wow. <laughs> hey. We love the consistency. <laughs> you know? So this is no, part... Part what? Part two. 
-hmm. of trying out restaurants in Kigali. Yeah. I've been here like a lot of times. And but when I asked coffee, Kiri Mama, Kiri Mama top, bro. And then we were like, why don't you have milk? And we don't serve iced coffee with milk. And then we were like, what do you guys have milk? And they're like, yes. Can you add milk? No. no. It's like the customer is always right, guys. And I was like, okay, bring no. me, bring me milk on the side. Now I know they're gonna charge me like five k <laughs> for for this cup of milk. So let's first rate the food. Honestly, yeah. the pizza was. Both together, I'll give it a seven. Here, all together, I'll give it a nine. Cause I like the pizza here. I've always yeah. liked it. So like, if you like pizza, which has like a thin crust, yeah, not too much on top, yeah, then Soledona is your go-to place. But if you're the type of person who likes Hot more pizza. action on the toppings, then this is not your kind of thing. But it's really good and it's very nice and yeah. My experience here would be a seven. <laughs> the service was not that great. I'm gonna be honest. The service yeah. was not that great. They did, whenever they bring something, they don't ask you if you want something else. We have to ask for the chilies so and everything. Overrated. But hey, maybe it's been a long day for them. You never know. But yeah, it's not a bad experience. A seven is a good. And it's Number. nice for taking pictures. Yeah, it's very aesthetic and pretty. Shot, 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 shot. You actually look. Bombastic side eye. Like, subscribe, comment. The truth, I look better under you. I can't lose.